This is the wood setup portion of the 2015 Ladies Golf School. So let's start from the ground and work our way up. So to set up with a wood, whether it's a fairway wood or a driver, the setup is very similar. As you see with the driver, the ball is teed up a little bit higher than the club head. As you'll notice in both pictures, the feet are a little bit wider than hip width and shoulder width. As you work up, you'll notice that the shaft is actually pretty straight up and down in both pictures. One thing we don't want to see in either picture is your hands or the shaft press forward over your forward thigh. A good rule to follow is to keep your hands and the club shaft slightly forward of your button on your shorts or pants. As you continue to work your way up, you'll notice that there is a slight tilt in the player's shoulders on both pictures. You'll see that in this case, the right shoulder, the right-handed golfer, is a little lower than the left. This is because the right hand is a little lower on the club and the ball position is slightly forward. This, in, this position here encourages us to create more of a sweeping motion rather than hitting down the ball creating a divot. Now that you're set up for success here with both your fairway wood and your driver, all you have to do is make a nice full turn back and swing through to a balanced finish. Let's let these ladies demonstrate. And now onto the fairway wood. And you can see in both cases there was no divot taken, whether the ball was on the ground or on a tee. They created a nice sweeping motion and went into a nice follow through position where the weight. and entire body here are balanced right over the left leg. So thank you for participating in the 2015 Ladies Golf School. Hopefully this driving video helps you.